if we see this graph, then uh, here on the bottom, we see uh, 0 to 10 volt, uh, volt uh, control signal. And uh, here we see the actual flow. And you see that the different colors of lines basically represent different settings of the valve and also different pressures. So different available pressures. If you, um, uh, if, if you see how it responds, basically, you see that it always responds in the exact same way uh, at the exact same predictable ratio. So uh, it's zero to 100% at all pressures and um, and all settings and it will always give you a straight line uh, with uh, uh, with regards to the to, to the control and this is important because you want to be predictable in your control because that will make the control of your system that much easier because if you remember the control loop um, then um, uh, then basically you have a response that is created by the control device. If this control device is very unpredictable, so um, so the one time it will give you a um, a very large response, and the other time it will be give you a very small response. Then it is very difficult to control. I mean, it. Let's say if you're driving a car and you're you know, using the gas pedal, and at one time, you know. Uh, uh, Pressing it a centimeter will give you, you know, uh, almost nothing. And the other time, one centimeter will go from zero to full flow, full, uh, uh, full power. Then this will not be the easiest way to control your car. And I, I, I'm guessing also you will get some speeding tickets. Um, so predictability is really important, and it also basically gives you the um, the actual response that you want.